gold medal match, 130 kilos. Rizakaya Alp at the age of 33 won his first of five world championships back in 2011, over a decade ago. Won again in 2015. Nine world championship medals for Kaya Alp will tonight be the double digit tenth. Standing in his way from the Islamic Republic of Iran, Amin Mirazadeh, the 25 year old. He took two losses at the Tokyo Olympic Games. One was to Kaya Alp, the other to Cuba's Milan Lopez. Very talented wrestler, a world silver medalist, two time Asian champion. A good one here to close out the night. As we see now, both of the both of the whistles are just uh, feeling each other very low with the with the body posture, almost uh, 90 degrees. Frederick, let's talk strengths of each wrestler, starting with Mirazade. He's very very movable. He is uh, he has fast fast feet. Um, um, he looks like he can yeah like. Um, 96 kilogram, almost a step out now. Speaking of footwork, you were right on cue there. Good job by Mirazade. Kaya Alps on opportunity for a step out point, but Mirazade would not budge as he was able to reposition. Kaya Alp will get the opportunity though with that last exchange to go parterre. Passivity point on the board, a 1-0 lead, looking for the reverse grip. Front headlock. Yeah, switched it to that front head. See the movement underneath, trying to spin him over. Gets him up off the mat. Up a little bit. Still has that front headlock up. position, but it slipped on him. Mirzade trying to capitalize, but Kaya Alp able to recuperate without giving up any damage. But seeing this in uh, 130 kilogram, that's amazing. We saw Mirzade's flexibility in the patel position in defense, but then Kaya Alp, when they were standing up, he moves like a 67 kilogram guy there. That's amazing. Yeah, there was a split second where Kaya Alp was in a vulnerable position. Yeah. Good job, Parterre defense underneath from Mirazade. Now the thing is, Mirazade, he has the maybe one point criteria in the second period right now. Final few moments of this opening period. Kaya Alp with the passivity point. And after three minutes of wrestling, a one nothing lead tight with Kaya Alp and Mirazade. Riza Kaya Alp earlier this year captured his 12th European Championship. We talked about how 23 could be a historic year for the Turkey A legend Riza Kayal. 12 European titles tying Alexander Karelin and his 12 European championships. And now on this Friday night in Belgrade, the capital of Serbia, everybody watching to see if Riza Kaya Alp can pick up his 10th world championship medal. But a battle in front of him with Mirazade. Two wrestlers who faced off in the spotlight of the Olympics in Tokyo and now with their ticket already secured to the next Olympic Games, it's all about world supremacy tonight. And we're off and running in this second period. Now we see a wall between two giants. And look at the pummeling going on right now. Yeah. Kaya Alp trying to avoid the parterre and then losing the balance going down, but not stepping out of bounds. Mirazade somehow avoided the step out. My goodness. As we talk about before, the quick feet. But this is what Kaya Alp needs to do right now. And what a pressure he puts on the Saturday right now. 
The big Iranian went down. The earth shook, but he got right back up on his feet. Trying to maintain map presence here. But the territory of the map being claimed by Kaya Alp here in the early stages of this second and final period. Kaya Alp not letting him get back to the center. And for his effort, for the second time, he is going to get rewarded parterre. That's what a champion does. He knew he had to do it, came out, and imposed his will. Yeah, and if someone has to do it in 130 kilograms, it's Kaya Alp. His pressure from the legs is just so dominant. Mirza Zadeh not budging. Kaya Alp slowly, methodically working his hands into place. Will it be a quick, explosive burst? No. He's used a lot of energy in the opening minute 30. So has Mirza Zadeh, as you can tell by his body language, coming back up to his feet. And now we will see the, the lion heart of Mirza Zadeh because now he has to show and maybe do the same thing to get his opportunity down in that position. In a sport where it's so tough to avoid parterre, Kaya Alp, as he gets driven near the edge, and that'll be a step out point. Wow. So Mirza Zadeh, out of nowhere, won that, uh, the leverage. Single underhook and just down in his leg and just pressed out to a step out. A battle for gold as we hit the 60-second mark to bring it home tonight. But Mia Saturday won't get the one point because Kaya Elba already got it. In the he third. already secured it. Exactly. Very smart of Kaya Elba. Chooses to stay up on his feet here. A little pass by attempt. Oh yeah, now Mia Saturday he needs that uh, on the hook again. Trying to clear the hand defense of Kaya Alp. Fight for the wrist underneath these two barreling chest. 20 seconds to go. And as we saw uh, Kaya Alp in the final in European Championship where he was exhausted. We don't see that right now. Left arm under hook is in, driving Kaya Alp near the edge, and out of bounds they go. Oh my, with oh. six seconds to go, Amin Mirazade ties it up and has criteria. And right now with six seconds remaining, the Islamic Republic of Iran going nuts wow. in a frenzy. I didn't see that coming. What a timing. Six, six seconds left. Kaya out back into the center. Amin Mirazade in his second world championship captures gold for Iran. Look at those emotions right now. Wow. This is a moment he has been waiting for for so long. What a a junior world gold, a U23 world championship so close a year ago. And now he has taken down the Turkey A giant and he had to rally with two in the closing minute. This is something we don't see often in 130 kilogram. This is what so exciting, Mats. Wow. Yes, Asade, world champ. Maybe a defining moment in the